So if you want to know how a vehicle that wins the Rob Report, we kind of have to start with people like Gage. And Gage, you and you kind of just started clay drawing. You, yeah. you, you play with the clay, but you manufacture it. Yeah, um, so this is kind of like the start of the process. We have a sketch, which is it's then my job to interpret and translate from a 2D drawing into a 3D form. Yeah, so usually back at home, you're just covered in clay. I am always covered in clay. Um, I'm always rolling around on the floor, getting messy, uh, but it, this is the kind of way that we do things, and we've been doing it this way for years, and I believe we'll do it this way for years to come. So once we get through just a, a little quick sketch of this, then you go over and you show what it actually yeah, yeah, does. Okay. And so, let, let's just go over here and look at this. Now this is the Valkyrie, yep. not the DB11. No. But this is, uh, th is there foam underneath this? Yes, uh, underneath we have, uh, it's just a simple wooden block with rough cuts of foam which then we build up with clay. So we usually typically put around 30 mil of clay throughout and then we add and take away where we need to. And what are these lines here? Uh, these lines are something akin to uh, like a pencil line on a page. Right. So the designer will give us a rough idea what he wants, we'll interpret it and then we'll go back and work our way through the process. So. What Nino's done here, he's shown us where we, where I, he wants this line to come down to. So myself and the team will ease the surface down and move things, and that's how we slowly go through the design process. And that's just because when he drew it, he envisioned it this way. Yeah. And we have, you just have to re-sculpt it to, yeah, to his yeah, vision. Yeah. yeah. So basically, we it, it's cyclical. We go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. We work very closely together. Um, I mean, you can change one of these things in two weeks. It's so small and so quick to change these things. Right. And it, that's the beauty of clay. You can add, take away, and it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a great medium which to work. What's the silver side over there? Uh, the silver side over there is something that we use for presentations. It's a, it's a film called Dynock. We have, a, we have an example here. So basically, it doesn't ruin the clay when you apply it. You can oh, add it to, right. uh, to show the surface definition, the surface tension. You can read the highlights. Uh, and it's so simple to put on, you merely stretch it across the clay and just Brilliant. flat it down and then you kind of have like a finished surface. Yes. If we're not happy with it, we merely take it off and then you go back, work the surface again and you work it way through like that. Perfect. Thank okay. you so much. Thank you. Thank you for your time.